At a time when everyone is worried about their mental health, the Egypt Centre certainly saved my husband and me. As we were trapped in the house, the Egypt Centre provided a wonderful escape with their frequent and fascinating Zoom talks. We shall never forget the pleasure of being led by Ken via Zoom around the Egypt Centre's magnificent displays. Their online ABBA set collection is a joy to behold, a treasure trove of fabulous artefacts which is constantly being updated. Ken, Sam and Carolyn have pulled out all the stops to make the Egypt Centre the most amazing museum. Egypt Centre has been very inspiring to me the past year and I was really happy with them uh, launching the Egyptian trials that are made especially for children. I was fortunate and honoured to make audio files for the children. Egypt Centre was a huge success and honestly one of the best experiences I have had during the quarantine. Shukran. As somebody who is physically disabled with chronic health problems, the online courses and lectures put on by the Egypt Centre over the last 12 months really have been wonderful. It's meant that I've been able to see things and learn about things that I'd have real difficulty seeing otherwise. I'd like to thank everyone at the Egypt Centre because they really did keep me going throughout the lockdowns. Thank you. Ever since I started my student journey here in Swansea, uh, the Egypt Centre has always been one of the most supportive and accessible platforms for me and my friends and colleagues uh, to engage with the material past in different ways, especially during uh, the COVID pandemic. Uh, from the uh, numerous short courses they've run uh, and the opportunities to share my work as a student with members of the public uh, from all different ages and backgrounds, uh, to the rich online catalogue and ease of uh, communication and collaboration uh, with members of staff during these difficult times, uh, the Egypt Centre is really a hub uh, for open, creative discussions about both the past and the future, uh, which is exactly what a museum needs to be. Hi, I'm an international master's student at Swansea University, and unfortunately due to COVID, I have been studying remotely from the U.S. this year, but the Egypt Center has done a wonderful job in supporting their students both inside Swansea and outside of Swansea. They have done this by um, publishing their new online catalog, uh, Abbasit, um, doing weekly blog posts, doing weekly curator talks, uh, monthly Friends of the Egypt Center lectures, and through um, object handling courses. And um, overall, these tools have been really helpful in aiding uh, online object-centered learning and have made uh, the Egypt Center available for everyone, no matter where in the world they are. I first got involved with the Egypt Center in March of 2020. I heard a lecture online with Ken Griffin talking about um, an artifact that they had at the Egypt Center and it was mentioned that he was going to be giving a course on religion and I ended up uh, attending a lot of online lectures from the Egypt Center and all of uh, Ken's courses and it's really made the process of dealing with COVID much more interesting and meaningful than would otherwise have been the case. Um, Ken gave us a lot of really good resources uh, to help with our studies, and he also had me do a couple blogs, which I found very meaningful. So uh, I never heard of the Egypt Center before last March, but it's had a profound impact on my life, not just during COVID, but on into the future as well. It's a great success that the Egypt Center has made all its courses and events more accessible to the global audience via Zoom. And we were very lucky that it has launched its Arabic trials, which in abundance with its commitments to make as much of its content available to the Egyptians. I've written the first Arabic blog post for Egypt Center, which is something amazing to be able to express everything with your own language. And it's really fascinating how inspiring the Egypt Center collection for me to the extent that I'm monitoring the gradual lifting of the lockdown to be able to visit Egypt Center as it's on my bucket list. Working with the Egypt Center is a real pleasure and a privilege because of the expertise and enthusiasm of its staff and volunteers. You also know that when you collaborate with them that you're really going to be making a difference. 
not just to the local audiences here at Swansea, but also globally with many people who really wish to engage with the museum's excellent collection. I'm currently working with the museum on the installation of a new display called Egypt and its Neighbours. This display will really bring to life classical artefacts that are held in the museum's archives, some of which have never been seen before. The fact that we are really on schedule to launch this display later in the year really is testament to the museum's commitment overall to inclusivity, diversity and to making as much of its collection as accessible as possible to as many people. Three, two, one. Thanks. Thank you. 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 Thank